going on, everyone? Sam here with Layton Sports Cards. With this title. Uh, we're ripping 2023 Top Stadium Club Baseball Hobby, 8-box half-case break, number 24, pick your team style. Uh, names and teams here. We got Andrew H. with the Rockies and Rays. Got Bob C. with the Reds. Brandon S. Diamondbacks. Brandon R. Brewers. Brett S. with the Twins. Brian B. Guardians. Brian M. White Sox. Derek I. Giants Cubs. Duncan M. with the Padres. Fabrice L. Marlins. Frank M. Tigers. H.G. Royals. Jacob C. Blue Jays. Jason K. with the Phillies. John W. Nationals. Johnny H. Braves. Dodgers. Yanks. Rangers. Kazuki N. Uh, Angels Mariners, Keith J with the Orioles, Masatomo K at Mets, Michael P Astros, My T uh, Red Sox, Ryan B Athletics, S Wayne Cardinals, and Talon H with the Pirates. So good luck here, everybody. Let's do it. Chris D with a couple of uh, Leaf Artist Sports spots. Thank you, buddy. Sen C with the Marlins. Thank you as well, buddy. That's a nasty lineup. Look at that. Ty Lawson. <laughs> My God, the guy who's got like five DUIs. A young Evan Fournier in there. <laughs> yeah, Daniel, Daniel Gallinari, like prime Gallinari. Vladimir Guerrero Jr. Andre Miller. Andre Miller, the manimal Kenneth Fareed. He was awesome, dude. He played in the... That poor guy played in the manimal. wrong... Manimal. Uh, he played in the wrong era. Yeah, he did. He did. Uh, we got Wilson Chandler, Corey Brewer. Oh, my God. Young, like, pretty good JaVale McGee. Sonny Gray, red foil. And then Mozgov would turn into a somebody for later. Yeah, he played in Cleveland. Yeah, he especially. played in Cleveland, and then he... <laughs> he got the bag from the Lakers and did nothing. Freddie Freeman. Easy pool hall's variation here, Adam. Let's go, dude. Let's go. That'd be dope. I prefer that Nuggets lineup than the, the Knicks lineup going forward after that. Jeez. Yes. Lee Resort, Joe Ryan. Our point guards, we ha remember our point guard situation? Was it Pablo Prigioni, right? Before Pablo. So, like, when they traded Ray yeah, Felton, we had... They saw Stone Garrett for the Nationals. All we had was Tony Douglas and Chauncey Billups. Oh, God. Tony Douglas. Yeah, that's And rough. Chauncey Billups. At 39 or 40 years old. And that's when we picked up uh, Jeremy Lin. Oh, yeah. And insanity. Insanity off the waivers. And then, yeah, Paolo, Pablo Prigioni out of... Uh, Verlander. Was he Argentinian or Italian? I forget it. He was Italian. I think he was Argentinian. Was he Argentinian? He might have been. I don't remember. I think he was Argentinian. Carlos Roldan. <laughs> yeah, I, I loved Pablo Prigs, man. Yeah, he was like a Nick hero for a while. Yes, he was. Yes, he was. That is Nolan Gorman, Kyle Ripken Jr., base and base. Couldn't speak, speak a lick of English, but he definitely knew how to control the court. Uh, Dennis Eckersley, Luis Severino. And that had to be tough, too, because, like, how the hell are you supposed to communicate with the guy, too? Right. Melo's like, no, just give me the ball. Right, I was going to say George Kirby. ISO, ISO, ISO. Harrison Barnes, Bogut, Richard Jefferson, Festus Azili, Brandon Rush, Kent Bazemore, Hawk Legend. That is orange, Brandon Nimmo to 199. Jarrett Jack, dude. God. JJ. JJ with the headband. What was Curry's rookie year? Oh nine. Oh nine. Knicks were one pick away from getting them. I know. The That's Warriors wild. hopped up and traded for the pick right in front in front of us, and then yeah. who did we get? Jordan Hill. That Jordan Hill. Oof. Knicks legend. Lakers legend. Mitch Carver. Nick Latoma. Jordan Hill. Dan Musial, and a Greg Weiser rookie auto for the uh, Yanks. Congrats on that. Yanks, Steer, and Dwight Gooden on the next one. I have a, I have a real tough time watching the Knicks, man. I've, I've been through the... Will Clark. Uh, you went through those were like, like the mid-2000s to like two years ago were just... It was the just early 2000s, man. like with the Latrell and a bunch of nobodies on his team. True. We had Zach Randolph. Gunnar Henderson Crow. Noah Syndergaard, Labor Torres, Black Foil. Yeah, no, true. Yeah, looking back, the Timberwolves in 09 took two point guards before they before Steph Curry. That's right, they did. Yeah, they took um, uh, Rubio and then Johnny Ru Flynn. Yes. Yeah, oh my God. Blake Snell, black and white for the Padres. Oh my lord. Yeah. He stunk. Johnny Flynn stunk. Yes. Rubio was good for a while at least. I mean, he's not. Ob he, he, would you rather have Steph Curry? Obviously. Clearly. Will Clark, but Rubio when he came over was very good. For a very long period of time. Played very good, very high level of basketball. Yeah. Every, anywhere he went, too. High IQ. Jack Peterson. Yeah, one of the best passers of our generation, I would say, would be Rubio.
Yeah, no, it's true too, G Mac. On our green, Ethan Small rookie auto for the Milwaukee Brewers. Congrats, Brew Crew. It's 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 kind of like as a Knicks fan, like it's like the most New York thing because like there's as much as the Nets exist, like no one's a Nets fan. Right. There's nobody that are Nets fans. No. So like the <laughs> with the New York thing, you got the Mets, Yankees, you got the Jets, Giants, you got the Islanders, Rangers. So like the Knicks are like the one Montreal. thing that has like everybody from New York put together. Yeah. And it drives them all insane. Red foil, David Ortiz. Uh, Shinsuke O with a stadium club and uh, logo fractor mixer spot. Thank you, buddy. Even when we had Patrick Ewing, he had a bunch of nobodies around him, and he somehow yeah, managed to get them True. to the finals multiple times. Even on, like, a bad, bad legs, too. <laughs> yeah, also very true. Mm. That whole situation when Curry got drafted, Robert. too. Like, if he didn't have that run in the tournament, no one was going to be picking yeah. him up in the first round to begin with. Yeah, and then he dealt with injuries in the beginning of his career. He dealt with, like, an ankle or foot injury for the first year or two of his career. David Ortiz. Hmm. <laughs> That's pretty funny, actually, Vaughn. Nolan Jones. Can at least make Knicks fans pay for tolls. I think there's like a whole situation going on with the tolls up in New York now. I think they just changed something where if I think you're coming out of state, they're going to charge you more. Right, or, or if you're borough to borough, they're charging more. So I don't know. Israel Pineda rookie auto dice when they're national. I just know the toll situation is getting worse for. I'm sure it's going to just for the amount of cost. I can't imagine the toll situation will ever get better. You know what I mean? It never was. Yeah, it was never good. The we'll never Whitestone, I think, I remember doing like the Whitestone Bridge and that was like an $18. Ronald Acuna, yeah, so well, it was GW, dude. GW. G uh, GW. Yeah, the GW the $18. Yeah, I went to, um, uh, before I moved down here, uh, I went to a card show in New Jersey for uh, one weekend. I just drove down, because it was only like a two-hour drive. I was like, all right, I'll do it. Why not? On a Sunday, it was fun. Gunnar Henderson, but I had to go over the GW there and back. It was like $40 in coal. Oh, yeah. Really? Yep, 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 yep. That's how it be. Uh, Black Foil, Bo Naylor, Mike Yaz, Luke Gary. Uh, Larry Walker. Jalen Brunson has the chance to be Steven like, too. like he, they could make statues of him. Yeah, like one of us beloved Knicks in history. Yeah, they may like, honestly, rename the street. Instead of like, what was it? They're on 33rd or 34th Street. Mm -hmm. Jalen Brunson Jaylen Street. Brunson Boulevard. Brunson Brunson Way. <laughs> Mel Ott, Red Foil. If he somehow gets us to a championship. Firefly. Please get out of here. What? Please get this guy and ban him. Fireflies by Owl City. I, I mean, a great song, but like, what? I know. You sent, he sent me and Jake a group chat last night. Like a, a, he was like me right now, and it was just Fireflies by Owl City. And I was like, get this guy <laughs> out of here, man. Uh, Freddie Freeman. Oh, Vaughn. A Levon Soto. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Planet Earth turns slowly. It's so funny because I I actually put that song on a on a Brett queue B. on a playlist at home Scott yesterday. Peterson. Did you really? Yeah. So me and my girlfriend face. were singing that out loud. Oh my God. Why were we getting diced up on FIFA? Yep. Right. Yeah. Right before I hopped on FIFA to Red get foil, smacked up a bit, I was singing Fireflies. I like to make myself please. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And then get smacked up on FIFA. Set, Seti Wap, Cedric Mullins, the 199. Or or get called on offsides again. Dude, we got called on so many freaking offsides, bro. That was, there's, uh, there had to be like well over 20 offsides. Cold minted was Anthony Rizzo. I just went there for the Yanks. I don't know, somehow, Matt Wallner, somehow, whenever we had like an uh, offensive chance, we'd get it offsides, and whenever anybody else... Any other team had an offensive chance, they would just blow right by our defense. Yep. yep. When I moved to offense. Yeah, that's all right. We'll get better. Room to improve. Oh, absolutely. It's the roots. We did get called, called on a lot of offsides oh, yesterday. Too many offsides yesterday, dude. We got called on so many offsides. 
Who's our biggest? Uh, Simeon Woods Richardson. That is an auto of David Hensley. Nice one there for the Astros. Who's the biggest violator of all time? Sean or Bofa, dude. It's one or the other. One of the two of them would get called an offside. Dylan would get Dylan, offsides. Dylan, Dylan was, yeah. Because Dylan was always trying to break away from everybody. <laughs> Red foil, Alex Verdugo. Clean auto, David Hensley's Hensley. got one of the nicer autos for sure. Because he was clean. in uh, he was in Top Chrome, too. Clean, sir. Clean. That is a Mike Trout. The oversized box loader. All right, let's start uh, moving some Donra spots here, ladies and gents. We got 24 to go on the first one. $50 spot, random team style. It's going to be Donra's basketball. 24 to go. I think so, for sure, Forrest. I just packed that 99 Bryce Harper. I know, yeah. Uh, Jake showed me the video on Saturday. That was kind of nasty. Yeah, I was like, What? I have him in that 99 Cal Raleigh. I was going to take the, uh, who was the pitcher that they had the 99 of? Um, Yuri Perez? But I, oh, yeah, for the Marlins. Uh, Josh Smith. But I was like, you know what? I'd rather have a catcher. Yeah, no, I don't blame you. Raleigh's nice. Too. Raleigh is good. Probably he's probably got stupid power. Yes. Going yard of uh, Aaron Judge, A.A. A. Ron. A.A. A. Ron. Arson. Arson Judge heading to the Giants. Nine years. Way to go, John Heyman. Way to blow it. Hey, man. John Heyman, man. Um, Brandon Woodruff. Paguetto and more base. I'm more of a Joel Sherman kind of guy. I like Joel Sherman. That's uh, David VR. 20, no, it's 23 to go in non risk basketball. I said 24. It's actually 23 to go. Uh, Chrome of Big Poppy, Josh Bell, Black Foil, base and base. It was fun though, dude. I had a lot of fun playing it last night. It is night. fun. I really did. But it, it also can get to the point where, like, just how like Madden can drive you crazy, 2K will drive you oh, crazy, yeah. FIFA, FIFA will, drive, will you crazy. drive you crazy. You'll get to that point. Like as much as you love playing it, it'll Keith get Hernandez. It'll get to you. Yeah. If I heard. Dun, 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 oh my dun, dun, god. Dun, 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 they hit that oh on like seven times. Black and white Corbin Burns, nice one there. That was an annoying so stupid, goal bro. sound. Kyle's just like, turn the music off, bro. Turn yeah, the music turn off. It off man. Uh, Kyle Stowers, Black Foil, Rogers Hornsby, and the Pasquatch, Pascantino. Base and base. And Kyle would gritty every time. Oh, my God. They're so pissed. <laughs> yeah, the, the guy so hit, pissed. kept hitting the gritty, damn it. The freaking purple afro. Yeah, purple what afro. Every single dude. Yeah, yeah and, and they also have, like, bright pink cleats. Oh, yeah. Christy Mathewson. All of them are maxed out. They just remake a club, start from D10 again, mm -hmm. so they can get everybody. Beat up on all the all the LSC the lowly. boys. And as soon as they get the D7, D6, and they got to restart over because they get stuck. Marcus Wilson, base rookie auto, nice one there. Red Sox, congrats, Boston. Uh, base and base. Thank you, Mister Mark, picking up a spot in the Donruss. Appreciate Marky you, buddy. Mark. Appreciate you, buddy, for sure. <laughs> There's not a lot to talk about this morning, so the question is, the topic is, is Mahomes already the GOAT? Oh, my God, dude. They're just squeezing out as much Super Bowl talk as they can. Dude, dude. Alonzo. <laughs> is he already the and GOAT? And then it'll be like a month, and then all they'll do is talk about, like, free agency. Oh, what's, what's going to happen here? Who's yeah. going to sign here? Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's going to be like one freaking the whole Lamar situation last year. When I was banging my head and just table every time he put a ESPN on. That was so weird when he wrote that letter to the fans. Like, like, is that a good buy? There's Alex what? Call, rookie auto, for the Nationals. When he put it out, I thought it was like, oh, it's it? That's it? He just it's did over. that. That's, players do that a lot just for leverage. Like, Debo Samuel did the same thing to try to get leverage in trade talks. But he did that once he realized that. What's up, Chase? That is Derek Jeter. It really is, to be honest. You're not wrong, Vaughn. What's up, Chase? You know what's kind of funny about that, too, is like, if Mahomes win this, wins this Super Bowl, and say if Mahomes wins, like, I don't know, three more Super Bowls or whatever, like, you're going to have people, it's like, it's obviously going to be Brady or Mahomes. Like, in the NBA, it's obviously Jordan or, or LeBron. And then you're going to have, in both sports, you have, like, the psychopaths that are like, oh, dude, Kobe Bryant's the best basketball player of all time. Like, he's not, but fine. Or, like... He was the bridge between, like, Jordan to LeBron. Yeah, there was that Kobe. Where? It's a 50. 
Like, Kobe's great, don't get me wrong. He's not the best base. He's not the best basketball player of all time. No, no, you're no. Just wrong. You, think that. You, you, you could be Sorry. one of the best shooters and Yeah, he's one of the best scorers. Shot creators ever. He's Mitch uh, Hanniger. He's one of the best scorers of all time. Right, exactly. But it's going to be the same thing. I give uh, I give that crown to Shohei, honestly. Until someone else can do it as good as he has, he's been doing it on both sides of the ball. Brass Happer. I feel that like, is Caleb Killian. I feel like Shohei's kind of like in that goat realm. He will eventually, potentially, if he keeps it up. Honestly, there was a long debate for years about the goat talk about in soccer. Like, is it Cristiano Ronaldo or oh, Messi? Hobby. Yeah, true. That, and then you was, have the people who think that that was a long debate. Yeah, then you literally just have Gretzky and hockey, and that's it. Yeah. How we going, Chase? I just show, hey? Yeah, even like Crosby is like a, a... He's coming to the end of his career. He's probably not going to get that GOAT label as Gretzky did. Even though like... Vladdy they, Jr. I mean, he's already won a few, but... Yeah, I think that's fair, Joshua, but I also think that that team was arguably, outside of the undefeated season, the best team Brady ever had, was that Buccaneers team. That defense won that Super Bowl. There's Andrew McCutcheon. That defense won the Super Bowl. His O-line was fantastic. Right. He had two all Pro Bowl receivers. There's a reason why he went there. Back. There was a reason why he went, he went to Tampa. Yeah, they, no, for sure. They were a they quarterback were away ready. from going to yeah. <laughs> run it up. Tony Gwynn. There's a reason. So that was just, that team was stacked. That team was so stacked. Like, I still think, I'll always probably think Brady's the best of all time. I'll yeah. Pretty much always I'm, say I'm that. a Jets fan. I will always say I'm that a Jets sure. fan, and I, I have to, yeah. That's easily. Jordan Alvarez. That's another thing, being a Jets fan. I, that I Hello, had, Josh. Well, good morning, buddy. I knew every season for football was going to be like, all right, let's fight for second place, maybe a wild card. <laughs> True. <laughs> That is Bo Bichette on the chrome. Black foil, Von Grissom. And he did that to Jets, Bills, and Dolphins fans for almost 20 years. <laughs> almost 20 years. How miserable years. was it being a, a In AFC the East NFC, fan? Uh, AFC East is the worst between 2001, 2000, 2001 like, yeah, like 2019. to 2019. That was <laughs> the most miserable experience. <laughs> Pretty tough. It's Nelson Velasquez, rookie auto for the Cubs. <laughs> Imagine going into like the football season for two, almost two full decades saying, like, all right, here we go, second place. Let's try to get there, guys. Dwayne H. with a spot in Donruss. Thank you, buddy. That's down to 21 to go now. 20, uh, or no, 22 to go, excuse me, 22 to go. For the Knicks, was like, all right, let's try to get that eight spot. Let's try to get that eight spot. AC, here we come. <laughs> And uh, let me drop you guys the link to Bowman University Chrome Hobby and Chrome Choice. Uh, 16, or no, 18 to go, I believe. Bowman Chrome U Hobby. Which one? Um, Bowman oh. Chrome University Hobby and Bowman Chrome University Delight. Nice, nice, nice. And then 21 to go. 21? On Delight. And then 27 to go on the second dollar. So. That is Manny Machado, oversized box loader. Yeah, true. McDavid's got to win, man. Yeah, Connor's got to. He's got to throw on like two, win, two championships, and then like another MVP or two. And yeah. yeah then, then, then we'll have that conversation. But he's got to win at like two. Mariano Rivera. Get to that Wonder second Franco. championship. Uh, first one, he's got to break through. But yeah, he's still he has not, not won a championship. No, yeah, so, like yeah. he might be on the wrong team. That's another thing. Yeah, he probably is. So. Ryan Kreidler to 199 on the orange. Like, the Oilers have had top draft picks for almost two straight decades as well. And they yeah. still can't they still can't get there. Senga. That is Zach Thornton, or Zach Thompson, excuse me, Zach Thompson going to the Cardinals on the rookie auto. Also, uh, big news in uniform games. Uh, the MLB released the spring training hats. And I'll be getting, like, five of them, I can tell you that right now. I'll be oh. getting the Cubs one for sure. That one's so sick. Is it, like, the little bear? Michael Harris. Yeah, it's literally, it's powder blue, powder blue cr uh, crown, that navy blue brim, and then it's just, it's not even the C, it's just the bear. 
I like that. I like that logo. I want that one. Go back to that logo, Chicago. Finish the statement. If Blank would have stayed healthy, they would have been the GOAT. Okay. I love that. I love um, this. That's a great one. I love this. Give me a second. Let me, let me marinate that. Mm. That is Ken Griffey Jr. The D-backs hat's really nice. It's all teal, dude. It's wild. I'll show you the, I'll show you the picture of all of them. The Mets is pretty cool. I think it's just all orange. Okay. Hmm. Griffey. George Brett. That's a that's a good name. I'm trying to go across all sports here, right, too, yeah. man. I'm, I'm thinking um, of like all sports. Like I'm thinking of even like Craig racing Beach, yeah. and golf, soccer. Mario Lemieux. Yeah, Penny Hardaway. That's a very good one, Brandon. That's a very good one. I feel like Mary, Mario Lemieux, he he's still a legend. He's he's yeah. got, he's got legend status. Yeah. Penny Hardaway. Oh, Penny Hardaway is a really good one. I think Tracy McGrady is another one. That's an Nolan Arnott. I think Derrick Rose. I think Derrick Rose would have yeah. been a lot. I don't not. I don't think Derrick Rose would have been the greatest, but he would have been much. He would have been really good. Hmm. NBA does have some big what ifs for sure. Like if T Mac had better knees. Greg Oden. Like, yeah, Suzuki. What if? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, Greg Oden. Greg Oden would have been one for sure. Like Brandon Roy is another one that comes. Yeah, oh, Bill Walton's Lord. another one. Yeah. There's a lot of NBA guys that come to mind. Josh Chisholm. Yeah, sorry, Blazers fans. Sorry, yeah, sorry, rough, sorry, man. sorry. Rough, dude. Yeah, Penny Hardaway's a good one. I'm trying to think, like, baseball. Whose career got ended early in baseball? Or, like, like, just that could have been really goats. Insane, yeah. What was that one young kid on the Red Sox in the 70s that got, he got hit in the eye with a baseball and ended his career after his, like, second or third year in the league? When was this in? This was, like, the late 70s. Late 70s? Uh, Vaughn might know that. I don't know. I'm not familiar. Ah, I forget his name. I should know it. That is Adolis Garcia, Aaron Judge. Like he was like a hyped up rookie coming up out of the Red Sox, and still like you know it, it was a long time before they won, obviously. So like they were talking about this young kid coming so, up, and then like one of his earliest seasons, like first or second season, he gets a pitch to the eye and ends his career. Geez. Ends his career. To fifty is Will Benson. Yeah. No, that's true. If it, yeah. like, that's a very good Tony. One too. Co yeah, there you go, Vaughn. That's the name. That's it. Yep. That's Terrell one. Davis is a good one, Jordan. I like that one. I think Bo Jackson would have probably been better had he not destroyed his knee as well. I mean, Roberto Clemente, his his life was short, too. Yeah, that's another one. And uh, Thurman Munson, Thurman you could Munson. put in the same kind of... I, I don't think Thurman Munson is as good as Clemente. Z Wang picking up a spot Clemente in Clemente could have... Like, he had three... He had 3,000 hits. He could have just... He could have he been in the league for another... Higher, yeah. Uh, he could have been up Joey there. Joey Votto. Lou Gehrig, yeah. I mean... Yeah, that's, yeah, Lou Gehrig's another good one. That's true. Like, there's a lot of names that, like, passed away early, too. Like, Drazen Petrovic is another one, too, in the uh, NBA. It was another one who passed away super early. All these guys that we're talking about, I just have sad thoughts about them. Yeah, no, I think that's... And I agree, man. Simeon Woods Richardson, I think I agree with that. Reggie Lewis and, and Len Bias, too, if Len they don't Bias, pass away. Yeah, Len Bias. Absolutely. Wow. Yeah, what a trap! What a sad story. Len Bias was man. Oh my god, that was awful. And like, oh my god, it was like his first time Wayne, doing right? that, right? Like it was. Like yeah, no, it was like a freak thing. It was I just think. a freak accident, kind of. Like, true, Danny. Very true. He probably would have. Jordan Walker probably would have smashed the home run record. Yeah. You're not wrong. Hmm. I'm sure there. I'm sure there's like a name that we're forgetting about. Uh, Ken Griffey Jr. refractor. You almost can kind of throw Tiger Woods in there. He's like he could have, he could have the record with Aaron all Judge. major. Right, he doesn't have the yeah, majors. Yeah, right. Does not have these three so away like, from the tying. So like without the car accident, his his knees. Yeah. I know. Like the later the the later years of him. Like he could have been playing nine. well into his fifties. It maybe yeah, no, probably. Competing. That is James Outman, uh, Jared Young, rookie auto for the uh, Cubs. Uh, Instavision, Riley Green. Nice one there for the uh, Tigers on the short print. Chubbs Pierce. There's Mookie Betts. Larry didn't work on his mom's stupid driveway. There's a uh, Larry Walker. Black and white, Nick Lodolo for the Reds. Uh, 
How old was Dale Earnhardt when he passed away in the accident? Was he, um, was he like in his 50s or 40s? I would assume 40s or 50s, yes. Vientos. Rookie auto of Ezekiel Duran for the Rangers. That dude could have had GOAT status. He kind of still does. He, he does. does. Yeah. I mean, yeah, the legend of him, sadly, that he did pass away. But... Lennon Sosa, Sean Murphy. Hmm. Now, Bonds was, yeah, Bonds never took steroids. That's another one, too. Barry Bonds in the Hall of Fame, dude. Just do it. Yeah, they all should just be in there. Jimmy Rollins, Hunter Brown, and Bass. Like, dude, it just, all it does... I am Joe. Joe. All, all it does, dude, like, is it, like, resembles a certain era of baseball. That's all it does. Yes. Like, steroids are very illegal now. It's not like the guys in the 70s and 80s it's, weren't doing anything. Paul Goldschmidt. I don't know, they're just doing coke, they, dude. They were just angels. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> just, just Doc Ellis was doing LSD ass, and LSD tossing ass. no haters, bro. Really? <laughs> we're gonna draw the. That's, we're not gonna draw the line there. <laughs> Come on. I know, my lord, dude. Right, exactly, Danny. Just get him in the Hall of Fame, please. Yeah, for real. Same thing with Pete Rose. Like, come on. Oh, Ooh, Aaron God. Judge. Nice one there. Oh my God, he gambled. Congrats on that one there on the throwback. That is Tommy Henry. Nice one there. Rookie auto for the Diamondbacks. Snow Angels. Exactly. You were right on that, David. Had to build the driveway all by himself. <laughs> There's Trey Turner. Yeah, and, and you know, Michael Jordan's just decided to take two years off and is the middle of a dynasty because he wanted to play baseball. Mm, yeah, yeah, Trey Turner. Mm. Mm, yeah, the guy who gambled like ten grand a hole when he played with his buddies in golf. Yeah, sure, man. Sure. <laughs> yeah, he just wanted to play. He just wanted to play baseball. Okay, please. That is Gabby Moreno on the refractor. That is uh, Red Foil Arena, Rosa Arena. Hello, Kyle. Didn't Lemieux, like, later also like, play... Oh, maybe I'm thinking of somebody else. Maybe he went over to, like, Russia or something to play. Or I think he was, he was always a Penguin, wasn't he? He was Did always... Did he play anywhere else but Pittsburgh? Did Lemieux play anywhere but Pittsburgh? Sammy Conspiracies? Damn right. I don't think, I think I'm a, a lot of people agree with me on that one, though. Hank Aaron. Jason DeLay. Nice one there. Beam Team short print, Michael Harris. Nice one there. <coughs> yeah, Mario Lemieux was a Tampa Bay Ray. Yeah, absolutely. Get this guy out, please. Go back to bed. You need some sleep. Man, too much FIFA. Too much FIFA. Go back to bed, dude. Dun 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 So Cleveland can take and get Kyrie. That is Seiya Suzuki. That is actually, because then there's a conspiracy, because they got, what, three first-round picks in a row? Yeah, that, that, that's actually, that is a legitimate conspiracy, that LeBron went to Miami, so with the plans of returning back to Cleveland in four years after that, the contract that they was up, get all these top because, picks. and then, and then it's, 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 like, theorized that the NBA gave Cleveland rigged the draft, so Cleveland got, you know, Kyrie and then Bennett and then Wiggins back to back to back to then use right. that for trade chips to get Kevin Love. Mm. What's up, Ryan? Well, that will do it for me today. <laughs> that is Hank Aaron, Blake Snell. I have my conspiracy goggles on, and I, I kind of believe it. It, it was rigged. rigged. It's a trap. Oh, theories? That is Derek uh, Jeter, Basin Shohei. 
Oh yeah, the frozen envelope. That's another one with Ewing to the Knicks. You know about that one, right? I've yeah. What was that all about? So they um the year what was it eighty five when, when he got drafted? Was, when he got drafted? Yeah. The theory is that the en- uh, Donald Stern put the envelope in a freezer when mm-hmm. they did like the little thing, so he knew it was colder. So he grabbed the cold one and give it to the uh, give it to the Knicks because uh. they wanted they wanted Ewing in New York to help sit like not save the game, but uh, you know make it more popular. One sure, Franco, sure. base and base. I mean, now, Stern was the Stern was nowhere at that sure. time. Hello. Hello. We've got a quick recap here. Uh, Jason DeLay, Tommy Henry, Ezekiel Duran, Jared Young, Zach Thompson, Nelson Velasquez, Caleb Killian, Alex Call, Marcus Wilson, uh, David Hensley, Levon Soto, Israel Pineda, Ethan Small, Greg uh, Weiser, Stone Garrett, and Will Benson at 25. I'll do it for the break, everybody. Thanks again for the film. Coming up next is Compact.